flies on this little stem buck as well. Very relaxed stem buck this way. I had a look at him this morning as well. He's trotting off there a little bit. <laughs> Beautiful. Doesn't seem like the flies bug him too much. I'm sure they do. An exceptional amount out this afternoon. One of my favorite antelopes. Fantastic little antelope, these you. Oh, here's the female Rex. Look at that. We didn't even see her. How amazing is that? Yo. She literally just flicked her ear at a fly, and that's what caught my attention. It's peripheral vision, as you probably know. Something we don't get to practice as much because we don't live out in totally normal circ or wild circumstances, but you know, just things like movement and, and subtle light changes better on your peripheral vision. And, not have seen it otherwise. Look at that. Perfectly still. This is quite special to see them together. Male and female. Stemmuck are monogamous. In other words, typically they sort of have a lifetime relationship. Also the female tends to be slightly larger than the male. This is something again you find generally speaking in, in monogamous species. You have to think about that when you think about humans and how we fit into monogamy or not if you compare us to other monogamous ones. And uh, well, I'll just leave it at that for now. Brilliant, you can see even the ears are flat. It doesn't want to attract attention. Specific pair, actually, we see them often enough that we can actually almost start naming them. It's maybe a bit early for it, but what I like about them is that they've become more and more relaxed with us as well. Basically, just the repetition of exposure to the vehicle and stopping here and not bothering them, they eventually learn that they can continue doing what they're doing, even if it is hiding in the grass like this. Ah, that's already made my afternoon. Brilliant little surprise. Just look, maybe there's a baby lying around here somewhere as well. You never, you never know. Oh, this is that female with the half ear. I haven't seen her for a while. I haven't noticed her, shall I say. How's that for a gap? Move on. You can see her neck is a little bit, is a little bit more alert suddenly. Oh. Oh, she's still relaxed. Look at that. She stood up. You can see the ear very nicely. Now, there'd be a story in that. Now she'll obviously still have pretty good hearing with that ear anyway. The rest of the workings of the ear will be very good. It's just your sort of your dish, if you want, is a little bit smaller on that side. It shouldn't affect it too much, but I would certainly have loved to have been able to know or even guess what happened there. Probably a predator. Maybe when she was young, it sort of looked like it got taken off nice and neat. What do you think, Rex? Close shave with a leopard, maybe. Ah, classic. And beautiful, beautiful view of them as well. Mr. and Mrs. Stenbach taking it easy for the afternoon. <laughs>